Hello Zebraherd, welcome back to Plants vs Zombies Battle for Neighborville. Today we're making more progress through the story mode in the town center, playing as another new plant class, the Acorn. So take a look at this guy, he has three abilities, the Sap Trap, launch a sticky knockback explosive, press L1 to detonate so we can do that, and then kaboom, launch it. We then also have the Invoke Oak, transform into an oak, joinable by up to three additional acorns, so they can just sort of show up and hop on top of you. And then the R1 is the acorn dash, quickly spin in the direction you're moving, so we can just go like, whoa, that's pretty cool. And he fires pretty quickly, he's supposed to just be like a little plant imp version, I guess. Uh, but yeah, I like it a lot. We'll, we'll turn to the oak later when we get into some trouble and need to fight our way out of it. That'll be fun. So yeah, we're to be looking around for some other quests we need to do. I'm mostly focused on, of course, getting our third part of the swag for the lawnmower. Um, maybe Mark can help us. If not, actually, I think we need to go to landfill. So we'll run over to landfill and try to figure that out now. That might be our best bet. So yeah, we'll get started with that. We'll try to make as much progress in the story mode as we can today. Maybe get a couple more chests if we're lucky. Maybe even run into a lawn. Not a lawnmower, um, a golden gnome or two, that would be awesome as well. Let's beat up some zombies. Ooh, this does some good damage though, I like it a lot. Very cool new class we have here. Let's put that there, big explosion. Okay, this is actually looking a little bit intimidating. Maybe we'll get the oak in, we're transforming, don't hurt me too much. There we go, now you guys are in trouble. First you, get you out of here. Actually, you are about to win, <laughs> be careful. Ooh, nice. Oh, I couldn't even see where the enemies were. I guess there was just a cone head attacking me from behind. There's a lot of zombies around here. Okay, we're back up. Where are we now? I guess by this guy. Well, I might try to dodge some of those guys a little bit. Is this a little golf course? Oh, that's cute. I like that. There's a little putt zone. Oh, they're back over here again. Luckily, this fires really quickly. This will be interesting to play online for sure. We will be playing a new playing class in the next episode online. That's probably going to be uh, the nightcap we played a little bit last story mode episode. Uh, oh boy, gotcha. Come on, come on. Be careful. Gotcha. And you over there, very good. Lots of stuff going on. I'm just glad when we get tacos. That's sort of the most important thing for me. The auto aim's a little strong though. I was actually trying to move over to the 80s action hero zombie. I like, was not working. There we go. Get out of here. Oh, that does a lot of damage too, so that's always good. There it is. I didn't quite get this guy. I can just throw a log at him. Oh, that's a weed. That's gonna help me. Okay, let's hop out. Will he explode though? He won't. Yikes. <laughs> I just wanted to get rid of him. <sighs> that's fine, that's fine. It does take a little bit of effort to travel around at times. Oh, let me get that taco. Thank you very much. But there's a couple of weeds over this way. And then there's a couple more guys over there. Just trying to do damage to them all I can while they're way over there and I don't actually have to deal with them. <laughs> He's sort of just like, what, huh, who, where? Come on, yeah, there we go. And you, thank you very much. So what is going on over this way? Here is uh, whatever his name was. He's a chomper. Hey, buddy. This is Landfill. Hey there, Sprout, you look like trash, which is good. So you're looking to trash Zen Sensei and grab his goatee? Like an ant in a picnic store, you are in the right place. All right, fight Zentrification. <laughs> the Uno Taco is the town's favorite place to eat. An upscale zombie brains bistro? Not so much. Defend the Uno Taco and grab Zen Sensei's goatee. We get a medal, cool goatee, 10,000 coins, and 25 tacos. Sounds like a reward to me. Fight Zentrification, defend the Unotaku, and get Zen Sente's goatee. I just read that. I don't know why I had to read it again, but I did. <laughs> I'm Landfill. I'm an expert on defending buildings and their tasty trash, huh? Major Sweetie says you need a goatee. How about Zen Sensei's? He's about to attack the Unotaku. Zen Sensei's, Z Zen Sensei wants to open a cool bistro that'll serve all organic brains if the zombies win. The Uno Tacos trash is the tastiest, like a bike in molasses, he's gotta be stopped. I've got my mouth full keeping boogie traps out of my sector. You'll have to defend the Uno Taco yourself to get the goatee. It's gonna get rowdy in a fun way, and then you can snazz at the lawnmower and stop old school, yes we could. Zen Sensei is there now, hurry. Defend the Uno Taco and vanquish Zen Sensei. Alrighty, so where is Zen Sensei at? He's over here, checkpoint reached. 
So we're just gonna go and beat him up then. Got a couple of zombies along the way. Get rid of this guy, please. Oh, come on, a little bit more, a little bit more. There it is. Who was that? Somebody was over here. Oh, it's a zombot. Just trying to clear out whatever enemies I can before it gets too wild, because that's gonna happen if I'm not careful. Let's get this guy, come on. The Conehead's a little bit more difficult. I feel so like bare just being the acorn. Like I feel like I need more teammates to help me out. Hmm, oh there he is. So I can't beat him up from here, he's all rainbowy. He's like invincible. So we need to vanquish the zombie guards. I'm trying to do exactly just that. I need to switch to this quick. Quick, quick, quick. Ah, I need to back up. <laughs> Who was over there? <laughs> there was a zombot. Of course it was. I need to be a little bit more tactical about how we go about this then, I think. So we'll try again. Are you trying? And where are we? We're way back here again. Is there any other angles I could go at? Yeah, I could go over this way. And just be nice and slow for now. We are playing as like a level one character. I don't have any of the upgrades applied. Let's beat you up. Gotcha, very cool. And there's more zombie friends, of course. That get them? Yeah, that sends them flying too. Oh, I love that move. It's a, a little hard to keep up with though. So I got that zombot down. No zombies in here for now. We're gonna move over this way. Just try to be careful and aware of everything going on. Gotta treat it like a stealth mission. Okay, not so bad. I'll launch that stuff over there and kablooey! Everybody's flying in the air. What do you think you're doing, TV zombie? I like the TV zombies, they're pretty cool. Hey, 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 watch it. And we got this guy a little bit. Now I think it'd be great if I could just keep moving. I guess I can't. Come on, not bad. Oh, I oh, didn't no, do as much as I was hoping. See, when I aim, it like sort of forced me to focus on the all-star there. I probably need to turn that down a bit. See, that doesn't do too much damage. It just sort of throws in the air, which I don't know how helpful that actually is then. The shield's sort of a problem. We should work on that a little bit. I have another log, that didn't do much either. They're not actually in the shield though. Oh my gosh, what is happening? Is there a zombie behind me? There's not. I mean, I think that, should, shouldn't this explode it if I go over this way? I don't know if that actually did any damage. Where is he? Cause he's like got a tiny bit of health. He's hiding from me right now. I don't appreciate it. Stop, thank you. Now get rid of this guy as soon as I can. And this friend over here. Oh no, do I have to go inside of the Uno Taco? That'd be cool. Oh gosh, oh, let's find out. No, oh, that'd be so cool. Are there more zombie guards? Maybe I gotta sneak up on them now. Uno Taco attack! Ow, that hurt. If this isn't doing much, I'm a little confused. There must be another zombie around then. Or there's more guards. All right, well, where are they? I mean, I know there's just one zombot over here we probably have to take out again. Was that really all I'm missing? Is this just, just this guy right here? No, you don't. Gotcha. That has to be everything, right? No, no, there's more. There's always more. Oh, see, that time I got him. Maybe I just like wasn't close enough before with my explosions. Okay, that definitely seems like everybody. Are you ready now? No? I don't think so. What about up this way? Oh wait, there's somebody. Oh, what is this? Okay, I thought he was doing something with a telescope. Maybe, maybe not. He gave me a taco, that was all of them. What's with the telescope? I'll we'll have to check that out at some point. I don't really know. Oh man. <laughs> okay, well here we go. It's Zen Sensei. There's Zen Sensei. Teach him no one zentrifies my Uno Taco. Where'd he go? Oh no, he's teleporting around. That did a little bit of damage. Okay, you know what? Oh, watch it. There we go. That was good, that was good. Come on, keep getting him. Hit him with the log. I need to be careful here, this hurts. It really hurts. Oh boy, where'd he go, where'd he go? He's gonna pop up right in front of me. Enjoy that, buddy. I don't know if it did any damage, as per usual. Uh, no you don't, leave me alone. Oh, I need to back up so that we can heal up. He's doing something. Okay, now I'm healed up, we're good. 
Oh, that did 15 damage. That's not too much, actually. Who's behind me? Oh gosh, zombies. Lots of zombies. That's not the way I thought I was gonna go there. So you can sort of control the direction of that. Gotta be careful of it then. Come on. I don't know how I feel about the acorn so far. Like maybe after a couple more levels, I'll feel a little bit better about it, but right now it's a little weird. Went over here real fast. Oh, and you're gone. Not good, not good. He's gonna pop up right in front of me like usual. There he is. No, wait. I'm, tra I'm transforming, wait. That's it. That sort of did a little bit. Come on, I gotta beat you up. Hit you with the log. The log does some good damage. That's good to know. Ow. Okay, I need to switch fast. Ooh, Zen Sensei is meditating. All right, well, he's trying to get out of here. Gah, he can't be hurt when he's meditating. Dang, inner peace. I'm guessing that means we need to fight some zombies. He's sending clones to open his brain bistro. Don't let him into the front doors. Okay, so now we're gonna protect the front doors. That actually might be where this could be helpful. Just put that there and explore it later. Plant yourself some pots. Okay, well, we can do that, no problem. Huh? Up this way. Actually, I'm really curious about this. Oh, there's something over there. I think that's its own thing. Like, that's not a part of this mission, so I'm gonna leave that for later. Uh, for right now, we definitely want some long distance action up here. I think the Gatling P is perfect. But because of the cooldown, I'll have to choose something different over this way. I could just do, I think Fume Shimmer would be good. And then over here, as you can see, we have, oh, we can do Doom Shroom or Bonk Shui. I think Bonk Shui would be good. And then over this way, maybe Doom Shroom. Sure, why not? Okay, well we got all of our plant pots set up. Let's hope that actually works. Nice work! Get on the roof and taunt Zen Sensei. It'll drive him bonkers. You would think anybody who would reach inner peace not, would not really care about taunts or just crude remarks. But I guess not. I learn something new every day. Okay, so yeah, I'll, I'll hop over this way and oh, just hold square to taunt. That was taunting him? I thought this was taunting him. <laughs> Okay, well, what's going on now? Oh, he really didn't like that. <laughs> Very serious of him. His clone kitchen staff are on the way. Don't even let them touch those front doors. Okay, where are they? Oh, here's one. Oh gosh, I think I exploded my thing. I don't know where, <laughs> if that really did anything. There we go, there's one. So I guess they'll all be visible from around here is the idea, I hope. Oh, here's another one. I mean, our plant pots are working on it. To some degree. That did some damage to him, that's good. I mean, maybe I should just plop down. I probably shouldn't be so silly thinking I have to stay up there. No, 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 wait. Oh, did I, okay, no, I can, it doesn't have to be all of them. I just have to keep a good majority of them. That wasn't too bad. Got it. And then this guy up there, definitely wanna get rid of him. No, don't you dare. Oh, darn it, gotta pay attention to that meter. Not doing so well so far. I'll keep trying to change that. So far they're not attacking me too much, luckily. Those clones are dropping tacos. I don't see too many more, except for this guy. Don't attack my plant pots. Leave them alone. Speaking of which, I should probably get over here and quickly plant another one. Whatever I can. I don't see any more oh, over this way. There's an all-star too. He's not a clone. Oh boy. Hey, no, oh darn it. That's not good. I'm making some major mistakes right now. Get rid of him. I see you over here. Hold on, hold on. Charge through. That's, that's not the button I pressed, that's weird. Okay, no, no wait, no wait. Just cancel, cancel. This is bad. Did I, I did not get him there, jeez. I am not doing well. <laughs> there we go, level two achieved, that might help. I definitely need to apply some upgrades to our good buddy the acorn here, soon enough. Got him, that was good. And then this guy, I'm sick of you. Get out of here. Oh, that broke your shield pretty quick. Got it. Uno Tago defended. That was pretty close, gotta be honest. Ha, that god Zen Sensei real mad. He's coming for you, watch out. Oh no, hold on. That at least did something. Come on, come on, come on, go, 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 go. I am in danger, in like real danger. Yeah, he really is chasing me down right now. 
I'm just trying to beat up all the zombies that are also chasing me down. There we go. I see you up there, buddy. You think you can mess with me right now? I don't think so. See, does that do damage to him, or did I just make like a grave mistake? Come on, come on, come on, come on! Uh, the problem is I keep on thinking it works like the mech, right? Where the mech will give you like a full health, but no, it's like we're still low on health. <laughs> so we just gotta be careful of that. Or at least that's how Imp worked in God of War 2. I don't know how he works in this game. Ow, yikes! I don't know what that's gonna mean for us. Do we have to retry this entire fight, or what? Zen Sensei is definitely not easy so far. Come on. And, okay. Yeah, I guess we sort of do. That was a checkpoint that we reached. So that's sort of a shame, unfortunately. Oh, he spawned some zombies that I immediately was able to damage or something. Or maybe I launched them into the air with the, the one thing. So I think he's trying to chase me down right now. So I'm trying to, as he's doing that, focus down these guys. Got it. He's up there. Let's try to be sneaky, hide around the corner a little bit. Oh gosh, whoa. Oh no, he's spawning in more. Get rid of this super brains before he punches me too much. Oh! I made some distance pretty quickly there. Okay, I think it's time for the oak. Oak time! Got it. There's no running with the oak. He has one speed. That's funny. Where is this guy? Oh no, you don't. Oh. Hit him with this, quickly. Got it, and then jump out of here. Luckily, we can jump out of that really quickly. What are you guys throwing at me? You throwing rocks? Don't throw rocks. Somebody could get hurt, especially me. Oh, that got him. There's a little bit more. Yeah, there it is. Okay, Zen Sensei, I need you to lay off right now. I think he's about to spawn in more friends. Because whenever he does that, usually zombies pop up. Maybe not, ow! Oh, there's Super Brains. This is bad, I gotta get up here again. Come on, go, 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 go. This has been really tough. I just need a second. Oh boy. Don't do that, please. Okay, I'm back to full health now. I think it's time to turn into Oak again. It's just crazy, it really is. But I've been loving all the bosses we've been going against so far. This, and then the Yeti, and uh, Baron Von Bass. They've all been really cool, like little stories and stuff. I've been loving the story mode. I honestly think this might be my favorite story mode out of God of War for 1, 2, which God of War for 1 didn't even have a story mode. And this game, I think this one might be my favorite. Like God of War for 2 had some pretty fun story stuff, but so far this has been amazing. And it's, it's only the tip of the iceberg. There's still so much more. Like a crazy amount more. Anyways, things are getting a little nasty there. That wasn't too bad. As I'm backing up from you, I'm trying to land some damage on you as well, but that might turn out very bad for me if I'm not careful. There's more guys over this way, jeez. I'm moving. There we go. Oh. You have a lot of health. My aim is very bad. So where's Zen Sensei at? Because we have him more than halfway down now. I'm gonna launch this. Did that not hit him? That should have hit him. Oh, I think he's leaving. I think he's had enough this time. Maybe. I don't see him anywhere. Ah, ha, ha, I saw I spoke too soon. Come on. Okay, his health bar, ow, for real went away this time. I think he's actually... Okay, Zen Sensei's meditating. That's what I was expecting. God, he's meditating again, and more of his staff are coming. Tend your posts. I will do that in a moment. I won't be stopping oak for now, I guess. Grow plant. Uh, this time, I'll do lightning read. I haven't tried that one. Ah, uh, it looks like doom shroom. Because of that, we we don't have that uh, pot plant anymore. We, or plant pot, <laughs> you know what I mean. Uh, because he'll explode the whole thing. So yeah, we'll go over this way. And we'll do Sentry P up here again. And then down this way, maybe this one could be Bong Choy. Sure, why not? There we go. What do you got this time, buddy? Kicking clones now, give them the boot. That will get Zen's attention, woo! Alrighty. So I gotta keep those clones out, no matter what. Gotta do a better job this time, that is for sure. 
As soon as they pop up, I'm gonna fire them down. Are you shooting at somebody? That'll be a good indicator of where they are. Whoa, he's fast, he's fast, he's really fast. That didn't do as much as I was hoping. Come on, ah, <laughs> I don't like you. I don't like you right now. Nice, okay, quickly. My, now might be my chance, it also might not be. Ah, uh, oh, come on, really? Not cool. Oh well. Here comes another one. A lot of them seem to be coming in from this side. That's what I gotta focus on for now. Did my lightning read get taken out? It looks like it did, unfortunately. Actually, no, it's right there. Silly me. Ah, he's knocking me away. Oh, nice. So what level are we right now? We're level two still. We're taking our time. Our gargantuan out too. Whoa, this place is popular, get him. I'll try my best, I guess. Oh, that was good. When you land it right on him, it's a lot of fun. I'll roll the log down, it sort of hit him. So, sort of is sort of good. Got him. Or did I? I don't know. <laughs> sort of weird. No, oh, missed out on that guy, that's for sure. Come on. Oh. Come on. That was good. Oak has a really good like goo blast or sap attack. Ow. That hurt. Nice, got him. I don't know where the gargantua is now. We need to heal though. Like we desperately need to. I don't see any more clones though, luckily. Ah, don't hit me, don't hit me. I just need to heal for a little bit. Whoa. Okay, I started healing. And then he started attacking. Oh, oh, yikes, yikes. Come on, don't hit me. I'm almost done. I really don't want to redo, I, I do not want to redo this whole thing if I don't have to. Okay, where'd he go? He's going around the corner. I think it would be an excellent opportunity to go up here and hit him from above. I hear him thumping around. Boom. There we go, there we go. He's gonna launch the imp at me, that sort of hurt. Got him. Uno taco defended. Thank you very much for the tacos, buddy. No more inner peace for Zen Sensei. You've got him now, woo! Oh gosh, speaking of getting, these guys are trying to get me. Ah, that's not what I wanted to do. Okay, this is a little weird. I need to back it up. I need to make some space, because this is uncomfortable. Jeez, they just keep following me too. Okay, let's get Oak out here. Just like that. Oh man. Okay, so where are they? They're all right here. That at least got him a little bit, I guess. Not entirely what I was hoping for. Jeez, they are just like really painful right now. I just need some time to heal and get rid of some of them. He's coming around the corner. He's really trying to get me. Oh gosh. Do that. Ooh, not bad actually. <laughs> that turned out pretty well. Oh boy. Got him. He's trying to get me. Still. Did that actually get him? I don't think it did. Definitely when you land it on them, it makes a big difference. Okay, come on. Oh, he is chasing me down, and I really don't appreciate it. Not more zombies. Come on. Get rid of these guys. Come on, one more, one more, one more. Got it. There's a little bit more time. We'll be all healed up. There's super brains out. Oh, he's gonna start hitting me back. I'm not careful. Okay, that was good, that was good. Almost got him. Nice, before he can land any damage on me, switch back over to Oak. Oh, where'd he go? He's gonna be right, right here, there it is. Hit him with the logs. At least this will do some good damage in the meantime. Ow. And then hit him with the logs again. There we go. I think now might be a good time to switch back over. Oh gosh. Uh, back it up. There we go. He is so low on health. We are really starting to get him much lower. Zen Sensei is definitely the most difficult boss out of the three so far. And I'm, I, I don't think, I think I'm the worst with Acorn so far as well. <laughs> Sorry about that. Come on over. I guess not. He's not interested. I'll wait for my health to refill again. And we will go back down there as Oak. That should show him who's boss. Cause he's like one fifth of his health left maybe, about there. Oh, that was good, I think. Actually, I don't know if he took any damage from that. <laughs> that was silly then. 
Where is he? Oh, he's right here, hello. Come on, get him. Ow, oh, no, don't get me, get him. He just won't give up, he has no quit in him. He's got an iron will. Guessing that's what meditating will get you. There we go. Come on, I definitely need to explode these guys because they're being too much on me. Oh, plant something, plant something, anything really. <laughs> I need the help. Hit you with the logs. You are just like getting lower and lower and lower. But so am I. This guy from a distance is hitting me, so if I could stop him. And this guy is not so fun either. Oh, that's good. A little bit more, a little bit more. Yeah, you better run. And then goop this guy. Oh, he is so low. I think I'm just gonna do this. That didn't hit him at all. Oh, dude, where are you? You're gonna pop right on top of me, aren't you? Here he comes, here he comes. I got him, level three achieved as well. Zen Sensei is taken down, now hiring. Not Brains Bistro, ooh, yikes. And there is our very nice goatee. I still, I'm super bummed we can't go into Uno Taco, but anyways, fight zentrification has been completed. We got the cool goatee. And we got the trophy Urban Brawl. Did you get Sensei's goatee, Yeti's bling, and Baron's hat? Yes, we did. Just kidding, I know you did. I see all. <laughs> now, with a pinch of glitter glue and a splash of zombie flop sweat. Ew. Voila! The lawnmower is now the mind blower. Just in time, drawing unicorns trampling zombies wasn't cheering me up like it used to. She is so just like charismatic. Mind blower, get past the Z Tech bouncers. So we'll be doing that in the next episode, I think. Or maybe now, I don't know what's going on here. They're hard to carry, so you can request a mind blower at special stations. That's cool. Whoa. Old exclusive club. Now get past it, now get past his bouncers and show old school your dance moves of pain. Okay, very cool. I always stretch before my, laying waste to my enemies. That's good. Now, to get to Major E, but the, not to get to Major E, but the whole town is counting on you. Isn't pressure fun? Use a mind blower to get past the bouncer into Old Cool's club, okay? All righty, I'll keep that in mind. She is adorable. Uh, but yeah, we will talk to Sergeant Peel over this way. Uh, zombies ain't what they used to be, they're worse. Landfill says my squad is like grapes coated in honey. We know how to stick together. Alrighty then, so we have 183, which means we actually can buy the chest map for uh, Sundrop Hills, which we haven't spent much time in whatsoever. So that's cool, I think that we're gonna spend, once again, the rest of today's episode looking for more chests and stuff. We still have 33 tacos. Oh yeah, the exercise tape locations. That's for the one human character. And then there's all this other stuff, so we, we have a lot to spend our tacos on, which is pretty cool. Tacos don't go bad, do they? I hope not. Anyways, so yeah, we have lots of different chests to find around the area now, so like we have this one. It's weird that some of these popped up now because of this map, like isn't that weird? Or maybe they're just now popping up because I'm making progress in the story or something like that, I'm not really entirely sure. But I will get more of a chance to explore around. We got this cool looking RV. And we'll be able to enjoy everything. I don't think I can hop down there, unfortunately. But there's so much to do and explore. Uh, we'll go over this way. Oh my gosh, there's so many zombies. Let's do that. Yeah, I got him gooped. Oh, that was good, actually. Nice. Get rid of you. And I see you over there. Wait, 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 wait. Gotcha. And it's nice that most enemies drop a taco, or at least some of the stronger enemies do. It just makes you know that, you know, you can rely on uh, being able to get more tacos over time. So where is this? It's apparently over this way, on the other side of this hedge, or something like that. Yeah, and this has probably been here the entire time, but it didn't show up until we got the Sundrop Hills map, I think. 20 tacos, very good. That's a common reward. That's fine with me. And we'll just keep finding these, at least in this whole area, I think is a good focus. Whenever there's they are available, I will snag some. And what about over here then? Oh yeah, so just right on top of this cool looking truck. I like it. Open it up, what's inside? 
we get 20 tacos again. Common. All right, oh yeah, there's this guy again. Keep those tapes coming. We haven't found any of the tapes so far, but once we do, I will help you out. Okay, so what else do we got going on around here? There's another golden chest. Like, these are weird. Well, let me get rid of you first because I haven't really found any of them yet. And when I think I found one, it looks like it's, it's going underground. Level five, though, for acorns, great. Whoa, whoa, that was weird. Just trying to get rid of this guy however I can. I might just switch to oak to deal with him. Cause he's being a pain in the butt. Ready for this? Oh, nice. There goes his thing. Yeah, it's somewhere in there. Oh, but there's another robot in the way. So I can't get to that just yet. That's what the golden chests are, they're the taller chests. I understand now. Gotta keep that in mind. So you see these ones, well there's a bounty hunt. Oh. Hmm, let me take a look at that. The bounty hunt might be, yeah, okay, yeah, I remember I'm running into that now, I remember. We'll be doing that at some point, that'll be fun. But I'm mostly just focused on the chests that we can reach, the ones that aren't grayed out, because those are the ones we've already collected. So we have one over this way, there's also one by the pier or something like that. So that'll be cool. Going up here for now. Ooh, there's like this like leftover museum stuff around here. Why is this not in a museum? Instant dinosaur bones. Oh, maybe because it's all fake. What does that say? Camp near a lake. I'm guessing it's near a lake. Yeah, we've already found that chest. But somewhere in there, or up here. It wouldn't be in this building, we've already been to this building. Oh, I wonder if it's like on top of it or something. It says it's this way. It must be like underground. Oh yeah, we got stuck on this one before. It must be underground or something. Oh, hello. Back at him, at least a good chunk. Oh man. Come on, why is my aim so bad today? I don't know. But I'm glad that we defeated Zen Sensei. It'll be cool to check out Old School and his boss fight, and then do whatever else we can do with the mind blowers next time we're in story mode. That's definitely something I'll focus on. But yeah, it should be over this way at the least. Oh, there it is, there it is. Nice. Come on, knock this guy off. Very cool. And what is inside of this one? We get 7,500 coins, that's not too bad. Ooh, the Yeti's back. Okay. I'll try beating him up at least a little bit. He'll drop something. Oh, I get him? Ah, oh, not quite. He's a tough one. But I do enjoy the fact that he's just running around. We've already beat him once part of the story mode, but not in this event where he just sort of runs around. I would love to get him, so I'm gonna try this now. And he's gone. The treasure Yeti has disappeared. I guess I might tell you in the bottom left when he's appeared, so I gotta start looking around for him when that happens. Anyways, I can't get this chest because it's like underground. Who's attacking me? These guys all are attacking me. Okay, run, run, run. I don't like this right now. Because that's sort of the problem with our good buddy here is that he has very low health, and that can be a bit hard to work with. Oh gosh, especially against this guy, ow! He just popped up out of nowhere. There are lots of zombies around everywhere. But yeah, what I was looking for, I guess is more chests. Like there is this one right here. Hopefully that's actually in a reachable spot. But we really don't know until we just go there. I mean, this one looks like it's gonna be on top of a building again. Or underground. Oh no, no, it's right here. We got it now. Can you guys just leave me alone? I just wanna open treasure chests. Yeah, this is technically Sundrop Hills, where we are right now. Isn't that weird? 20 tacos, very good. So let me get over this way. Yeah, like that's all Sundrop Hills, I guess, from here onward. I don't know when we're gonna explore this stuff, but there's at least a bounty hunt over that way. Let's go this way, because there's that, one, that one's already along the path. Leave me alone, I think that's an all-star attacking me. Oh, have I ever gone down here? I mean, I think I did to take on Baron Von Batz at least at first. So I actually don't need any of this, the sewers. And there's probably much more to the sewers than I even realized, so that's cool. So that there's much more to this map that we have yet to explore. And what's inside of here? 20 more tacos. I don't know if I'm earning my tacos back by all that much by buying the maps. Of course, it seems like I'm still like losing more than I'm gaining, but it's still worth it because I planned on completing all that anyways, and it's useful to have the extra help. 
There we go, got rid of those two. Who is still chasing me over here? Literally everyone. Come on, got him. So what else do we got going on? There is a chest over here. It's just technically a part of Sundrop Hills. Where exactly though? This might be another underground one, it has to be. Either that or I'm really bad at looking around for stuff. It'd be so cool if we could go inside the building. That'd be really awesome. I'm not seeing it though. So I'm gonna take a pass on that one. What about this one? Ooh. That one should be straight over here. And it's not there. So I know that there's a sewer right over that way though. So I understand why that one might not be working. Um, but I just wanna get a couple more if I can. If that's at all possible. There's a couple on the ocean over this way. Man, it seems like there's a ton to explore here. Like, this is so exciting. There's also, oh yeah, is that, I think that's probably where old school is. Where is this one? Uh, I don't know, I've lost it. <laughs> uh, it was this one, yeah. This one has to also be underground. I'm not having good luck with that. Or no, it's telling me this one. I already got that one. Weird. Maybe we'll get a couple on the beach. We'll finish it off with that. Maybe we'll go back and finish it off and be done. We might also open, I've been earning a lot of coins. I would love to earn or open one more pack. One more capsule back at the, uh, at the, the neighbor bill. I never know what to call it. It's not the backyard anymore. I mean, sort of is, right? I don't know what it's actually called now. Anyways, we gotta defeat this Gargantua if we wanna get any farther, which I ow, definitely do. Oh man, there's a couple of other guys too. Captain Deadbeard's coming in. Nice, that actually hit more than one person. Use the log as well. You guys just aren't being very kind. Also have to defeat this Captain Deadbeard. Uh, multiple Captain Deadbeards. Isn't that just pleasant? Ah. Oh, he's a champion too? Oh, look at him, he's very fancy. Whoa. <laughs> get back here. Get back here. That's it. Captain Deadbeard taken down. Now, other Captain Deadbeard. If I have anything to say about it, which I don't, run, 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 run. Oh boy, got him. Okay, so you just really backed up there for some reason. Nice. I love landing that, it's a lot of fun. I'm really interested to take this guy online and see how he plays. Got him a little bit. Back it up, ow, ow, ow. Come on, we almost got him. I can't give up now. Oh, I never actually exploded that. Silly me. I'm at five health. I was at six health for a second. Let me just hide for a moment. As long as no other zombies pop up, I should be okay. There it is, there it is. Get him! Oh no, come on a little bit more! Yeah, we got him! Apparently the treasure yeti was back, by the way. But we got the gargantuar, more importantly. And a treasure chest. Inside of this one we have level six. And a thousand coins for the level six. And 30 tacos, nice. Okay, buddy, you're going down. If I can manage, oh no. But yeah, it is cool that we found the chest maps for all three of these locations in the whole town center. We'll go over this way and set this waypoint. What are you doing? And what about over here? Oh, it's up there. How can I get that? Can I just jump? I guess I can, as easy as that. Oh, this is a nice view too, I love it. This is 50 more tacos, now it's really starting to stack out. Oh yeah, and what's the deal with this? Is this still not available? Uh, hunt, Captain Featherbrains, oh, I see that's the bounty hunt, gotcha. Well, for right now, we'll try this out. One more chest over this way, some way, somehow. There's another Captain Deadbeard. I like how the Captain Deadbeards are all by the ocean. <laughs> Very fitting. Oh no, oh no, this might have been a mistake. Might have been a mistake. Yeah, that didn't do too much to him. But that might. Yeah, we got him. Very good. Now it's just you. Yeah, you better run. <laughs> he was really trying to get out of there. I sort of feel bad. Okay, one last chest for today. Open this one up. You sense a faint gnomish energy. I wonder what that's about. 30 tacos. Where's this faint gnomish energy? Are we gonna find, oh. Maybe something with this. Or not. No, 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 in a circle. 
or I guess there might be something up there. We'll have to save that, because I'm out of time for today's episode, but this has been a lot of fun, for sure. Got a good couple levels with the acorn as well. We're level six now. We're gonna quit the giddy park though and finish it off by buying a capsule. Okay, so we have ourselves 298,000 coins. I'm just gonna buy one capsule for right now for 30,000. That'll bring us back to the 268. And like I said, I'm slowly trying to earn up more. We got the fun Porium pods, part of the fun Porium Explorium set. Oh, interesting. So we got a part of a set there for the Space Cadet. That's really cool. But yeah, soon enough, I'll be earning up more and more coins that hopefully we can get to the 1 million coin marker and do a spending spree for um, this game. And uh, hopefully by episode 10, that's my goal. But for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Plants vs. Zombies Battle for Neighborville. Before you go, be sure to comment Sensei Zebra so any of you watched the end of the year, a Zebratastic viewer. Also, subscribe to join the Zebra Herd. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.